This is Glitzy Glam. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, subscribe. Uh, I gave you a run through of my craft room, but I thought I would slow down a little bit and give you a few extra details uh, what came from Dollar Tree, 99 cent store. And if you see anything that I show you and you want to know how I put it together, uh, I can just request that and I can uh, do a video on a how to uh, as well. But uh, here we go. Three, along with pillows from my, that were passed down to me from my grandmother. I have this 99 cent, uh, I don't remember how much I paid for it, but I bought it at the 99 cent store. The cutest little stuffed flamingo, but it goes real cute with my theme here. Here are some extra flowers I have stored there for when I need them for a party. Now this, I bought these little bins. This was um, Bargain Bethany did a lot of videos with these little bins. And you can get these bins at Walmart as well. But I bought these at Dollar Tree. I bought these jars at Dollar Tree. All of them have beads. Lots and lots and lots of beads. Here I got a pizza pan from Dollar Tree. I got the this sticky paper from a uh, shelving liner from Dollar Tree. And all of these magnetic things from Dollar Tree, they hold even more beads. These beads up here are for more older girls because you have to use a sharp needle and thread for those. These are more pony style beads with big holes that they can just stick a string that's taped on the end that, to make necklaces for a little bit younger crowd. Um, these I got each at Dollar Tree for my sewing. I have bobbins in the top, safety pins in the middle, and needles in the bottom, and I just glued them together. This thing here, I just want to show you this little thing here because my grandfather made that years, years, years ago. It's not, a, it has nothing to do with Dollar Tree, but I wanted you to see that because my, I'm very happy to reuse that my grandfather made it for sewing and he died when I was in high school so I love showing you that now these are these right here are from the dollar spot at Target and the reason I like them is because that they're slanted and they just hang you can they do have holes so you can nail them into the wall but I like that they just hang now these gold racks are cooking cooling racks from the Dollar Tree these are pencil and pen holders from Dollar Tree and those little flowers are from Dollar Tree so I can say let's see one two three four five six seven eight dollars for the rack these were three dollars a piece so eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fourteen dollars for this whole setup including the pretty flowers and then I have another one over here I bought the calendar from Dollar Tree so that side I bought two of these metal rulers so again one two three four five six six dollars for this side so not too bad it's very cute and then I use these I'm probably gonna get a few more of these so I can put markers in them and then this is a clear acrylic. Now this did not come from Dollar Tree. This came, I think, from uh, Office Depot. And it holds all of my papers for this little baby here. 
my silhouette machine. All right, that's all I'm going to show you on this video, and then I'll show you my drawers underneath my desk. They're not too pretty, but they're nice and organized, and I like that. Thank you for watching this segment, and tune in for the next one.